My name is Michael Young and I'm a lawyer who handles will contests in Texas. In this video, I'll talk about how dementia uh, plays a role in testamentary capacity and why dementia is so often uh, a consideration in will contests. Uh, a person in Texas must have testamentary capacity before they can make a will. And that generally means of sound mind or good mental capacity. And specifically, it means does the person generally know the assets that they own? Do they know who their family members are? And one of the elements is that they must have sufficient memory to collect in their mind the elements of the business that they're transacting and to hold them long enough to perceive their relations to each other, and then to be able to form a reasonable judgment. Well, dementia is a general medical condition that can encompass some very specific diseases such as uh, Alzheimer's. But a common symptom of dementia is the impaired ability to think, to reason, to make good, sound judgments that a person would otherwise have made before they uh, had dementia. And unfortunately, current medical care uh, can only do minimal to relieve the symptoms and almost nothing to improve the symptoms. And dementia is progressive. It only gets worse. But a, an effect of dementia that I particularly see in will contests is someone often becomes paranoid. They become angry. They have enough mental capacity to understand that they're losing their abilities that they had, their ability to think, their ability to function day to day, their ability to drive. They essentially lose their freedoms. They become upset about it. They become angry, and they lash out at the people around them. Uh, that is one of the insidious things about dementia. They, they get mad at their doctors. They get mad at their loved ones who are trying to care for them. And that often can lead to rash decisions. And, and you see it often in will contests. Somebody with dementia, impaired mental ability, will cut out members of their family, uh, members that they've been close together, maybe longtime friends, It'll be a radical change in their estate plan after they get dementia. It's common. And unfortunately, it's just a symptom of the disease. And if you're involved in a will contest, or if you believe that you were cut out or excluded from an estate because the testator had dementia, it's very important to contact a lawyer who has experience in handling will contests where testamentary capacity is an issue.